Check out this view. So we just left San Diego. We had so much fun. We actually ended up meeting up with four different families while we were there and had a big cookout last night over by, well, not cookout. We made it simple. It was bring your own drinks. Did it after dinner time with um, by our RV and um, just with the campfire going. And yeah, it was a lot of fun just to hang out. There was like 17 kids there. Is it fun, Max? Yeah. And the kids ran around and played until I think like 11 o'clock at night. And now we are all exhausted, <laughs> but it's all good because it was a good time. So now we have moved on to um, Menifee, California. And we are here as for just one night so that we can then bring the trailer in tomorrow to get all of stuff fixed on it that has broken. Um, the fridge, long time without a fridge. Ready for that to be fixed. The crack in the ceiling, the table being broken, variety of different things. So looking to drop that off tomorrow, hoping we'll have it back by Thursday or Friday and um, gonna be heading to an Airbnb to stay there while it is getting work done. So that should be fun too, to stay in the house for a little while and just kind of hang out there. I don't know if we'll leave the house. We might just hang out, just do a lot of cooking, watch a lot of TV on a big TV, just kind of chill out like that. I don't know, we'll see. The Xbox. Well, this guy says we need the Xbox change from Knox to Cannon. Um, so yeah, so that's where it's at right now. So we're just gonna, gonna hang low today, get the RV kind of cleaned up so we can drop it off. And then tomorrow, get up early, drop it off there to get work done and check out Airbnb. the Airbnb. Yay, we'll show you guys we're there. So this is what we got going on right now. We got a pretty big mess back here as we are trying to go through all of the stuff in the RV to get it cleaned out and situated so that we can bring it in to get it fixed. When you travel in your RV and live in it all the time, you don't really know how to pack that much anymore. Of course you do, but it's just a little bit more of a hassle to kind of try to figure out um, what we need. And then I think the Airbnb we booked is up in the mountains and we just checked and it's like 40 degrees. So I guess that means that the <laughs> flip-flops that are going away and we are getting out the warm or cold weather clothes so yeah so trying to get our stuff packed up here so that we can get ready to uh, take off first thing in the morning and drop the trailer off all right so here's the punch list for the rv warranty work the fridge completely broken the wall or the crack in the ceiling and the wall separation from the exterior wall on this whole side of the rv Tanks not draining properly. The slide out hitting the floor when it comes in and out. The table just is a leaning tower of pizza right now. The screen door, the screen's ripping, the handle broke, etc. etc. The light above the stove burnt out. There's trim all over that I had to cut to make things work, so I want that replaced. Uh, the Velcro for the seat cushions, because the seat cushions fall all over the place. The bumper end caps. The bumper end caps fell off somewhere along the way. Need new ones. Uh, there's screws like in the wheel well that just rattled out. This window sticks when it opens and closes. And then we just noticed that the shelf under the sink um, is really sagging. And the, one of the support bars underneath by the water heater, like, broke off the wall so yeah that's it short list short and sweet hopefully they'll knock it out in a week here's my list it's official contractor punch list so here we are to drop the trailer off to get some work done on it we had to get up too early for that we had to get up at like 6 15 in the morning we don't do that stuff anymore and we had to wake the kids up before seven so we could get in to the car and try to get the trailer here by the time the place opened of course we had traffic we got here late you know blah 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 anyway so we got the car like packed to the gills and i mean see it back there packed to the gills with the stuff that um we are going to be bringing with us um we think we're going to an Airbnb. We didn't make the reservation because we weren't sure when we got here if they were going to say like, oh, let us look and if we need to order parts, then you guys have to take it back or what the whole deal was. So we kind of waited on it. But 
hoping we can get that figured out while we're here and then um head up to the airbnb and hopefully the trailer will be fixed in a few days fingers crossed here we are at the shop i is in there walking around showing him all the stuff that needs to be uh fixed so we're just hanging out here in the van waiting all right craig's getting ready to drop the trailer here at the warranty place so did you go through the list yeah i went through the list i gotta go back in and see what he's thinking as far as time frame all right was he excited about all the things you had on there he was like, holy cow, how'd that happen? And a couple of them. <laughs> Alright, let's see what happens. Dropping her off to get her fixed up here at the repair shop. So we dropped off the trailer and we're waiting for the uh, Airbnb to be ready. And the kids, um, after meeting with Life at Cool, are all about skateboarding! Not all so about Yes, you are. You were loving it. All right, they had fun with it. So anyways, Cannon has not stopped talking about it. Right, Cannon? That's right. He's like, bring it on. Get me to skateboard. So we are at the mall area, spending way too much time at Target in these stores. Crazy. Once you get out of Baja, just back into it. But anyways. It's great. It's so, fantastic. So we are here to Target check out squishies. the skateboards. Uh, this is the pharmacy board store. Here we go. We're going to check it out. All right, they got their new boards so check them out we got three boards they all got one so now they all want to practice on them but we are all boarded up and ready to go oh boy Carson all right let's see Carson let's check yours out it's a pretty sweet board you got there yep 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 now we gotta get their shoes on. They just had their sandals. We'll get their shoes on. Mom, I and have to get a shoe, shoes on, elbow pads, and a hand pads. I like that idea, buddy, while well, you guys are learning. So these three are gonna work on it. Knox, we're gonna let him use these to give it a try, too. No, he goes, Knox goes to get some. Knox likes to do the tummy riding. Um, yeah, that's all right to start like that, right? Oh, look at the bottom of those feet. Holy cow. Yeah, you can do that, too. All right, so we're gonna. These three are gonna do that. Knox is gonna see if he likes it and then we'll get another one if we need to. Oh yeah. So, this doesn't look like the RV, does it? Cause we got an adjustment. It's not. So we dropped the house. trailer off um, to get fixed and, and they told us um, maybe by Friday we'd be ready. So in the meantime, we rented an Airbnb. So we are going to stay in this place, which is like a full size house. Which is crazy. Um, Craig and I were just talking about this is, I think, the first time that we have had a full regular size fridge just to ourselves because the RV fridges are smaller and every other time we've stayed at someone else's house, we're sharing it with them. So first time, it's a pretty big deal. And we have a washer and dryer. Yay! Couldn't do a bunch of laundry, get the kids all in the shower and bath and do all that fun stuff. And then, yeah, we may not leave here. We may just hang out for a long time and just stay here. There's so one thing that sucks though. What? It's not a good place for skateboarding. Not a good place for skateboarding. Kids just got their skateboard and it's not a good place for skateboarding. We went up, 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 up the mountain to get here. So. Uh, me, I wanna show you something. Okay, we're, Cannon's gonna show us something. All right, Cannon, what are you showing us? Oh, wow. There is a Okay. Yeah, oh, me and Cannon found that. So, this is Dad. This is Mom. This is the little sister, Buddle, Buddle, and Buddle. Awesome. Those are so family. cool. This is huge. I helped them do Look at that. Crust. That is yeah. really awesome. Let's go and see the street. So, yeah, here you go. Here is, it looks like you got a nice big living room, a nice big kitchen, and I got the bedrooms upstairs. So, pretty sweet. So they're working up here in the bedroom, getting their babies. room set up no, like a is, nursery. This is my this is babies. The, and um, they're, they're, we are all going to sleep in this room. Oh, you're going up high? And we have and I wanted to have rooms across from each other because the, the babies get scared. I go okay, perfect. And I snuggle. Think of it perfect. They found somewhere to take the boards out. Oh boy, there's a lot of hills here. So, oh, and then there's the dog, the neighbor dog. 
We started the day with our charcoal mud masks. Check these bad boys out. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm not very good at putting them on. <laughs> it looks good. <laughs> so we went from the heat of uh, Baja up to the mountains in California. It is downright chilly up here. There was actually snow in the forecast last night. It didn't snow, but yeah, we are up here staying at our Airbnb while the trailer's getting fixed. So it is all good. It's been nice being in the Airbnb and just kind of relaxing, getting some work done, watching some TV, just really kind of chilling out. But got up today and um, took the kids with their new skateboards out to the skate park. Check them out. All right, there goes Knox. He's really learning how to skate there on his belly. Here comes Carson. He's doing pretty good. Nice. Cannon, you working on it? Oh yeah, working so hard it's time for a drink, right? <laughs> so what do you think about the skate park? Not good. Not good? You don't quite know what you're doing yet? Working I wish it was little and for like not so much people. Yeah. So we could like go up the ramps. Yeah. You're gonna just learn how to do it right now, right? Just staying on the board. So that is a wrap on the Airbnb. Yeah. yeah, that was nice to kind of be in a house for a few days there and uh, just kind of spread out. <laughs> get some work done. Get some, some work done. Meals, watch yep. some TV. Yep, the kids had a huge TV to put Xbox on. We so. didn't do anything, probably. <laughs> we did it. We <laughs> left uh, both days uh, for about an hour to go to the skate park, and that was about it. Yeah. But it's all good. That's so good. there it is behind us. And if you can really see Sitting it back in the there, trees. sit in the trees up there. But that was the Airbnb we're at, and definitely makes us feel like we should add a few more Airbnbs definitely. to our plans here. Yeah, that that's was good. that was fun. So now we are going to pick up the trailer. Hopefully, the majority of it is done. We shall see. Yep. Check out this view. We just came down from where Airbnb is and it's been cloudy, so we didn't get to see this view, but check it out. So pretty. We got her back. The trailer is ready for us to pick up. So um, yeah, the guy got uh, pretty well through the list. He had it pretty much um, rebuild one of the walls on the side. So, but he said once he got in there and did it that he felt pretty good about it. So that was good. Um, the fridge, he had to just mess around with it a little bit. Thought it could have something to do with the ammonia that got clogged somewhere. But then since we turned it off and drove for a while, we kind of re-jostled it. And he cleaned out some of the dust from Baja and some of the vents. And it's been working for four days. So let's hope that means the fridge is good to go. Got the table fixed. So the only thing we didn't get checked out were the tanks which um, sounds like they need it like really sanitized. I don't know if we could do that. So he gave us some tips to try some things. We're gonna give that a go and see if any of that helps and um, see what we can do there. But good thing was all under warranty, nothing from us. They got it back to us. We dropped it off Monday, picking up Friday. So pretty happy right now. So we are gonna get back on the road to go to um, our campground to then get settled in to then kick off this West Coast road trip. First stop's gonna be Disneyland. Boop, boop. All right, here it is, folks. We got it back. All right, Craig's getting it all hooked up, so we're gonna roll on out of here. Nice to have her back. Now we need to go figure out how we can give her a bath. <laughs> Get all that Baja stuff out of there. All right, let's roll. <laughs> 